Maya and I'm back with another video. Yes, I'm still in the same setting because I just randomly thought about this video because I have another video that I'm filming, filming today too. I just filmed the video just now, just a random little mukbang because I had to eat this morning. And now I'm going to film this um, maternity clothes haul. It's nice little bit of a trying one because I didn't really try clothes on. I didn't really try the clothes on. I just um picked up some clothes at the store. My mom bought me some maternity. Well, we went shopping and I got a little bit of maternity clothes. So I thought that I should show y'all how to look on me. Um, most of the sizes are like one X, extra large, extra larges. You know, bigger clothes because when I tell y'all they're growing so fast, it's just hard to find stuff that like fit me. It's just really hard. Like. My shirts, I'm busting out of everything. Busting out of my shirts. Pants are too tight around my abdomen. Too tight around me. I was like, oh my God. Yesterday I had to cut my pants because it just was not working for me. So for today, I'm going to just try on some of these clothes. I'll show y'all what they are. I don't really know if y'all want to know the prices. It really don't make no sense to tell y'all the prices. It's not like you're going to try to go buy them. So I'll just, you know, tell y'all what stores we went to to go get the clothes. So we went to Shoppers World. And we went to Wells. In this place called Didi's Discounts. I just needed like a few little things. I didn't really need a lot of stuff. I do probably need to go back and get more t-shirts though because I just realized that like I don't got nothing. Um, but yeah, I'll show y'all like how they look on me and stuff. So first thing we're gonna show, I'm gonna show y'all are these little sweatpants. They're in like a large and your girl that's that's one thing i really like sweatpants on thanks to you this this they really are comfortable and like just lightweight especially when i gotta walk around a lot during the day they're really comfortable and chill i'm gonna go try these on and i'm gonna come back over here and show y'all how they look so now i'm back and show y'all see i don't really like nothing tight right here but right now it feels fine um these are large see a little booty hoodie a little sunny sunny but i want shorts under here Wait, did I take my shorts off? No, I think I just put them over my top of my shorts like a dummy. But, um, you know, pregnancy brain is different. <sighs> but yeah, you see I just ate, so my stomach is like fully poking out. But like, as you can see, I think this was only like $10. I don't care. I just needed something comfortable. I like to be comfortable. So, um, I got like, um, two more pairs of them same and these same kind of sweatpants just different colors let's see i got no just one more pair of these two. okay and i got another pair my other pair are in well they call them joggers but my other pair are in this like brownish i mean this blackish grayish color so i have a gray and then i have this blackish gray i like them they feel really comfortable my baby's like comfortable so next i guess since we are in like stuff i'll show y'all these sweatpants they're more they're not the same brand they're like joggers as well and they like really like sheer they look a little sheer so you might have to put like leggings under there during the summertime i mean but during the winter since it's still winter but I'm gonna go try these on and let y'all know how it is. I'm gonna go try them on because they're the same. So be right back. Okay, y'all. So I really like these. Ooh. I really like how these feel. Like, see this? They feel so comfortable. And like, they're not even putting no type of pressure right here. And eventually, I'm gonna get so big that, like, it's just gonna be like, wow. I don't know what size these are either. It's gonna be like the extra large. I don't know, because that's why I was shopping in the larger extra large section. I'm usually like a medium, but not this pregnancy body. But like, I'm just, see? Boom. Boom, four. Boom. Really comfortable, really chill. Sweatpants, if you're pregnant, sweatpants your best friend. Sweatpants are your best friend. I'm gonna try, let me see. What's next? I can try on this shirt. Because it kind of goes with the black thing. I was going to wear leggings under this shirt. So I'll try on this shirt. And I'll show y'all what it looked like. Give me one second. Okay, so for this shirt. It's really comfortable and chill. I think this shirt is a 1X. So if my stomach stretches like a little bit more. Well, of course it's going to stretch more. 
And I think you can adjust the shirt. If I'm not mistaken. If you take yes, you can basically adjust the shirt to how tight you want it or how not tight you want it. And you know, you can't like right now you can't even tell I'm pregnant from you just would think that I was just a little chunky chunky, but and all the babies were here. But boom, I like this shirt. Really chill. I plan to wear it with leggings. I don't even know what it says. Rise up and oh, I can't read that. Not from from the way I'm looking at it, but yeah, I like it. It's a pretty chill shirt. This shirt was I don't know because I, I think the price tag fell off of it, but yeah. There we go. I like it. And then this with these chill dog is is even something chill too because can't tell. It's just like ooh. And so for some of these sweatpants, I do got a big old pack of um, V-neck t-shirts to go with them. But let's get into the next outfit. So my mom actually picked this one out. It's a little crop top um, sweatshirt. You know, just in case, I'm like, when my stomach get bigger, you know, I'll show a little. I can show a little here to tell me. It ain't nothing, but it's not going to be like, uh, maybe it will be like. Of course, I feel like my stomach going to go like right here. So it probably will like my stomach will be like yeah. But yeah, for right now it's perfectly fine for me. Just my speed. Like it and it's big enough for me to like, you know, just chill or anything. So yeah, next. Now oh it up. Okay, so now we have these little um one pieces. I have four of these, so I have this color. I have this nice cute tie-dye color. I have a white one with spaghetti straps. This one got spaghetti, spaghetti straps too. And then I have a new black one. These are all in a size extra large. So my usual size in these would be a medium. Um, but the extra large fits pretty snug, pretty like not too tight, but not too like loose either. But it fits like real flow, flow fitted. Um, I like how it makes me look like boom, baby. Um, it gives off like a real like nice show to my baby bump so far. I love. Um, one pieces anyway and I do have a black one which is like medium but but when I tell you it's been yanking me in like so tight way too tight for right now and I probably still wear these even even after pregnancy because I really like how you feel and I always love one pieces anyway um this one is not like as tight as I usually wear them I used to like them a little bit tighter probably would have got like a large but as my stomach grows I'm gonna need something way more chill especially during the summertime so I have four of these so you know and I like this color because I never had an orange color in this before so I like this I like this a lot and I have four of these I'm not gonna try on all four because it really don't make no sense even though the colors so it really don't make no sense I probably try on a tie down one just because it's don't got the spaghetti straps like these the other three so yeah let's go to the next one so now that I'm in the um, tie down one, you can see it a lot better. Three. I can possibly wear this for my gender reveal. I don't know yet. I haven't decided. I could probably wear this for my gender reveal because I have a cute purse that matches this. I actually have a tie dye dress, which I love so much because I love the colors and how it co coincides with my purse that I have. So I could possibly wear this for my gender reveal. And by that time, my stomach will probably be out of here. So you can tell a lot more than I'm pregnant. But for right here, I love it. And especially with it being extra large. And it's fitting so snug and good. Girl. <laughs> Girl. I really like this. I really like how it fits. Boom. Boom. Yeah. Mommy, Anna. <laughs> Let me stop. But yeah, I like how this one fits too. It's 
I mean, they all gonna fit the same, but yeah. So I'm not gonna try the other two on. I get the gist of it, but I really love these, especially during pregnancy. You do. Girl, be so hard. I'll be, so, be so lazy getting ready for anything. And I just, I love just throwing something on and getting out the house. Like, so these are going to be a lifesaver. So lastly, yeah, outfits. Um, I have this um, tie-dye sweatsuit. <clears throat> to be honest, I don't really plan on wearing the whole sweatsuit together. It kind of give off like a champ vibe. But for video purposes, I thought I should try it on together. Um, the pants are pretty huge, like, but I feel like it will be able to stretch to my body. But the wind is like with the t-shirt, the pants with the t-shirt, the sweatshirt with leggings, you know. Simple, this sweatshirt is like a 1X. Of course, when my body starts getting bigger, I can't be able to fit anything for real, so. This would be perfect, especially when it comes to springtime. And I don't have to really put on nothing, you know? So, um, yeah, this is really huge, though. I didn't think it was going to be this big. Yeah, but, you know, just simple, 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 simple stuff. I didn't try on everything because, I mean, some of the stuff is, a lot of stuff is just repeats of the same thing. But, yeah. <sighs> Look at my booty. You don't see it. <laughs> you don't even see my bump. That's how much. Like, look, I don't even look pregnant. I look like flexitated like, a little bit. But yeah, I can also show y'all since I don't feel like getting out of this real quick. <sighs> now we're doing this whole video without a word. Body tired. Out of breath all the time. So. I'm gonna try these on because to be honest, I don't really I got no pants to wear with. But I got like two little like sweaters. Put it back up. Another little sweater. Like a V-neck, little like long sleeve shirt. To be honest, I don't really need long sleeves because it's about to be hot outside. But to be honest, for right now, it's kind of a little cold and it's getting colder, so just for temporary stuff. I'm out of breath. Okay, so next are like intimate clothes. So like, if you don't like to see that, then keep on moving. <laughs> but girl, let me show you. So I definitely picked up two packs of sports bras. And let me tell y'all, I can't fit none of my regular bras. Like none of them. They're just like my boobs. Just like, baby, we cannot fit those, girl. I'd be like so over it but um i picked up this extra large pack that has like maybe it's just like does it look like a regular bar kind of but it isn't and it comes with two in the pack i picked up them because i'm sure my boobs are gonna get nothing but bigger and i don't like even putting on my regular bars anymore i don't even sleep in regular bars but also i picked up another extra large pack of two um, one comes with blue and then there's another one that's like a neon pink. So I got those. So girl, let me get into these drawers. Panties, whatever you like to call them. I, oh my god. So like, most of my underwear have like seams that's like irritating to right here. So what I, it's just so uncomfortable. And I be having to try like to find some of my underwear that don't, usually the ones that don't have seams are the ones. Give me a second, y'all. I'm hot. Let me say this. Oh. Okay, y'all. I'm back. So, uh, I'm back. Okay, but yeah, um, most of my underwears have, like, the little scene that really, like, irritates me during the day. And it be too tight. And especially at night, like, just be feeling like it's squeezing my thighs or something. Like, I don't know. Girl, girl, see my body's just getting bigger in general. So, I have gotten some no seam underwear. Um, I have like five, it came with five pair. I have a pair on right now. I think I got out of the shower. I'm gonna put a pair on, so boom. Seamless are gonna be your best friend. Please get you some seamless underwear. <sighs> seamless and satin. I mean, that silky satin, where do you be? I felt like I was sleeping like a baby last night. I ain't even gonna hold you. I didn't get up as much as I usually do. Um, 
I got me an extra large pair of these boy shorts. Um, wouldn't really recommend getting boy shorts for real, but I do get them just in case, you know. I'm like, of course I'm wearing them, but like, and those are one X when my stomach gets bigger, so I can like, you know, fit them a little bit better. Um, these are also one X. I have some hipster underwear. Um. They also got like a little bit of a seam right here, which might get irritating. I won't, I don't know yet, but they're one X. All my underwear are kind of bigger, just so they can fill over my belly eventually. I'm in a large in underwear, but yeah. Um, and I have some seamless bikini underwear. Seamless are going to be your best friend, I promise you. If you don't get no seamless underwear, you're missing out because you're going to really need them. And they're going to, they feel so much better, like, so much better. But I got me some seamless, a four-pack of seamless regular drawers. And they're on one X, too, because when this belly starts getting big, you don't understand. I'm going to need something as comfortable as possible. And I'm not trying to be back and forth at the, um, you know, back and forth at the stores. Um... And lastly, for underwear, I have these um, one size fits all big old underwear. Like, these can definitely go over my stomach because usually on me, these underwear will go like high waisted. So, these high waisted underwear can probably go over my belly a little bit, which probably won't be the case because I probably not want to go, don't want to do that, but we'll see. So, okay, that's it for this little mini maternity haul. Um, I have a lot of just repetitive stuff, that's why it's not it's going to be as long as I, you know, intended it to be, but, you know, it's just mini stuff, because I already bought some stuff a couple weeks ago, and I didn't do a haul on it, because it really didn't make no sense, it's not all I'm going to have, of course, but like a little bit of bigger stuff, just so I can wear it for right now, because baby girl, I'm busting out of everything, and I have a lot of jeans, but I have not been wearing any of my jeans, because it's just so uncomfortable right here, like, it's so uncomfortable and when you growing so big your ab abdomen pushes out so like all that that was down down lower is up higher now and it just feels so uncomfortable and it puts a lot of pressure on you too so i definitely needed some bigger clothes um and you're definitely gonna need some bigger clothes whether you're having multiples whether you're having a single tip whether you're having triplets regardless you're gonna need bigger clothes because i try to hold out on it and be like no i don't need maternity clothes i definitely have not been shopping in the maternity section like a lot of people do i'm not gonna shop in the maternity section because i don't think i need to i could just go get bigger clothes like i can still i can get them as y'all can see i can wear one x i'm not gonna wear no big old clothes that i don't really need and I hope to like you know get a little bit a couple wears out of them when I give birth and stuff so I don't want to like just get big old maternity clothes and never have to wear them again that's just a waste of time and money and especially because I'm having two and <laughs> who knows if I decide to have another kid years down the line I'm not going to want to keep no maternity clothes like no so these are clothes I'm okay with keeping if I need to like down the line if I ever want to wear them again after pregnancy I can still wear them because they're not that big up, you know, so. That's it for this haul. Excuse my rambling. But that's it for this haul. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Let me know if y'all want to see more hauls. Next, I'm about to film a baby haul. So y'all see what we have for the babies so far. Um, yeah, thanks for watching. Comment, subscribe, and follow me on my social media. No Taiwan is not here. Taiwan is at work. Um, also follow his gaming channel at Ty the God. I think that's his gaming channel name. I'll plug it in the description and I'll plug it during this part of the video. But yeah, see y'all. Love y'all.